In our second point today, we are rounding out our series, introducing you to the mayoral candidates for the city of Charleston. I recently sat down with the incumbent Mayor John Tecklenburg to take a look at his platform and why he thinks he's the right man for the job. Take a listen to a part of our interview. So election day coming up shortly. We want to talk about maybe your goals and things you're looking for in a third term as mayor of the city of Charleston. Well, well thank you, Raleigh. Mm -hmm. um, the number one job of city government is keeping everyone safe. So supporting our police and fire departments is the utmost priority for me and for city government. But beyond that, we have the ongoing goals, getting things done of stormwater man management, stormwater control, development is an issue. And one of the uh, issues that's come out of development is providing affordable housing. Because as we've seen uh, folks moving here, they love it here. Um, there's been a big demand for housing. Mm -hmm. And so working families like nurses, teachers, police officers, firefighters, they need to be able to afford places to live as well, working families. What do you see as the biggest challenge for residents in the city of Charleston currently? Well, I, I think the biggest challenge long term still is, is managing the water. Right. Every inch, every foot matters. And, and so these plans that we're uh, enacting now with projects like rebuilding a low battery seawall and managing uh, stormwater, West Ashley, Johns Island, and James Island are just vital to the future of our city. They're vital to the future of our city. As we get closer to election day, you know, what's your message to voters? What do you want voters to know as they head to the ballot box in November? Well, I would share with them um, my personal story that, that I love my job. I love getting up every day and um, having the opportunity to serve people. And um, what, what a great honor that is for me. Um, and share with them the passion that I have for this city and its future and our kids, uh, for the future generations to be able to enjoy this city, not just protecting from water, but having opportunities. You know, when I came along in high school, most kids that, you know, had, uh, did well in school and you knew they were gonna have a bright future, they moved away from Charleston. They went to other, other cities, other places, and, and now we have uh, a good economy and we can build opportunities for our kids to stay in Charlton and thrive and enjoy their futures. All right, Mayor, thank you so much for yep. your time on the show. We appreciate it. Thank you, Riley.